friends, this is Andy Vegan. Today, I really wanted to have raspberries. Very expensive, you know, get the good raspberries from the health food shop even. Oh, but I have frozen ones. I tell you, they are really awesome. I'm always at home, like for example, frozen strawberries, frozen, frozen blueberries or frozen cherries even. On the fridge, like corn or peas, sweet peas, all frozen, very inexpensive, organic, and whole year round available. And these raspberries, I will just take them now, frozen as they are, and put them into a smoothie bowl. A very nice smoothie bowl. I tried that before. Yeah. I have bananas here, the base, three bananas. You can even have some more doesn't matter. They are super ripe, as you can see, and that is very good because then the nutrients are fully versatile. All the starch has been transformed into uh, sugar, and that sugar is the brain food, the pure brain food. All has to, everything has to be converted into that sugar to have it our brain. Brain is the, the greatest user a consumer of energy of our body, the whole, the whole brain is the whole thing. It's a small thing over there, but it uses most of the energy. You can see what that means. <laughs> and here, I have macadamias, have been soaked overnight. You see they're really a little bit thick, and then they uh, jump open here. You see the openness here, the little here, that is from soaking. And then you wash them, and put them into the blender, together with a lemon. This is important to me, because otherwise the whole thing would be very sweet and it would turn brown also. It's also nice to put a lemon into a banana. And the third thing, for me, almost the important, most, most, most important one, lemon to me is the perfect combination with banana. You won't have the same effect with the orange. Put an orange in the banana, blend it, you have a little bitter flavor. This is interesting because the banana has something bitter too. But you know, usually, you don't notice the bitterness of the banana. You notice, it is so sweet, banana, yes. Oh, some people don't want to eat that sweet, it makes them fat, they think. Wrong, <laughs> wrong, totally wrong. Banana is very good and healthy, good energy. But with the, the orange, the bitterness of the banana comes fully out. Yeah? That's so, the lemon has a totally different effect. Lemon is made for, for banana. So, this is the kind of thing I'm interested in, as you can see, I'm pretty enthusiastic <laughs> over <laughs> because, um, because it, it works together so nicely, the lemon and the, uh, and the, and the, and the banana. And that also makes it nice for, for dressings and creams like this. Let's see what happens with the blender dance. <laughs> Because we have the frozen raspberries, it would be very wonderful. And this cream, oh, looks so amazing. I have to taste it before I show it to you. I have to taste it, sorry. <laughs> sorry, I have to. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh. oh, such a nice combination. I could eat it without the raspberries even. So good. The macadamias, ah, give it a little bit more strength, you know, a bit more creaminess, very perfect. i show you what it looks like. First, I put my raspberries here into the bowl. You have seen the raspberries. i show you just what it looks like now. When I put the, the cream on top, I will show you here. This is my cream, these are my raspberries, and this is my breakfast today. The nuts are already in, so it will keep for a while. And I can enjoy these wonderful raspberries that will thaw in a, in a second and turn the whole thing into total delight. Ah, how I'm looking forward to raspberries now. And there's something that happens here. We'll have a look again. Isn't that nice? 
Okay. Uh, the respirators on top now. The nice color happens here. You see it already begins. This is a wonderful play now with the, with the whole orange and the red and the rose, the, the red in the, in the light here. So nice. That's so much fun. And this is something that happens whilst we were talking that, that um, if you go to the kitchen and to the food in that way, when you have a, uh, easy food with a lot, small number of ingredients, and then you always go to the shop and look for something nice, what suits you, then after a while you begin to, to have a, a, a wish for something healthy, for example, a banana or a, a, today a raspberry or something. And then you have an, um, immediately a nice, easy recipe to fulfill that wish. And that makes your body really uh, in tune with your health and with your happiness. So this kind of, of cooking, very easy, brings me very close to myself. Food should be healthy and delicious. Of course, vegan, there's no doubt. Subscribe to Vegan on YouTube. Have another recipe every single day.